your local weather authority with Jessica Wheeler. Welcome back. There are snow showers on the Dorset Automotive Doppler radar that will remain throughout the afternoon. Quite scattered. Not a lot, though, with accumulation and cloudy skies on the Graber Post Buildings camera. This is an image of downtown Terre Haute. And again, that winter weather advisory, it is almost done for those further up north in Illinois. That will end at noon Illinois time. And again, those temps, well, right now at the Terre Haute Airport, we are at 30 degrees. It does feel cooler, only feeling about 22. And for those north winds, calmer than yesterday, about 5 to 15 miles per hour, 9 in the Terre Haute area. And for those lows, well, this morning, we were along 30 degrees. Low, low of 29. The record low, though, of negative 14. That was in 1977. We are going to have a cool couple of days as we check out the next five we are going to be in the 30s until the weekend as we do hit those lower 40s and we do have more precipitation in the forecast a brief mix once we do hit the hours of sunday so depending upon the time of this system could potentially be a mix later on turning into rain and regionally 30 right now in chicago it is 26 in south bend also 31 in kansas city locally our temps are in the upper 20s we are hitting the lower 30s, and that is going to be our high throughout the afternoon. So currently 27 in Champaign, 29 in Greencastle, again 30 in Terre Haute. These are the current wind chill readings. A few still feeling in the teens, 17 in Danville, 18 in Champaign. Highs today about 32. And for those winds from the north, about 5 to 15 miles per hour. Mattoon about 16, again, much calmer than yesterday, where those wind gusts were in the upper 20s. And on our Metro view, it is going to be a cloudy afternoon. We do have scattered snow showers in the valley, not a lot with accumulation. But don't be surprised throughout the afternoon if you do run into some sort of snow, as it is going to be, though, quite dry and also cloudy. And then during the overnight hours, we have that light snow as well. So on our future cast, cloudy skies again today. We do have that light snow moving in later this afternoon and this evening. Of course, you will see those flurries during the overnight hours. And once we hit the weekend, we do have some light snow in the valley as well. So tomorrow is going to be partly sunny. We will have a few flurries. And then once we hit Saturday, we do have those light snow chances. As you can see on the future cast, this is around lunchtime. This system affecting our southern areas. And again, snowfall over the next 48 hours. Not a lot with accumulation. A lot of light snow moving on through. A lot of those flurries. So it's not going to be too much as it does pass on through the Wabash Valley. And for today, those highs, 32 in Terre Haute. Again, light snow. It is going to be a cold one. North winds about 5 to 15 miles per hour. Wind chill readings, though, many in the 20s, some in the teens as of right now. And then for tonight, dropping down to about 27, we are going to have light snow overnight. And tomorrow, partly sunny. We are increasing to the mid 30s. Don't be surprised if you do see some flurries early tomorrow. And then on Saturday, we do have some light snow moving on through. Our next system we are tracking is going to be on Sunday, that low pressure system. And depending upon the time this does move in, it could potentially start off as a brief mix. But then later, it is going to turn to rain because we are going to be in the lower 40s. I do have to watch that one for sure, too, because we're going to my mama's on Sunday. Oh, yeah. Yeah, for lunch. Don't well, want to get stuck in Bloomington. <laughs> <laughs> no, you do not. I need you on Monday. Yeah, okay.